Hi, thanks to all the backers on both uh, Patreon and in the Kickstarter. Um, so this Friday, December 8th, what's going on in DimGuard? Well, the Volume 23 is closing on Kickstarter on Sunday. Um, and we're doing kind of, a, or at least I am, doing kind of a, a preliminary reflective process. So I'm uh, pretty happy with the uh, new management systems that we've put in place. Uh, Volume 23 has been much less hectic and stressful than any of the previous. Um, the, other, the other ones had the benefit of being exciting because they were new. Um, but to be honest with you, if, if we hadn't have fixed the managerial problems, I don't know that we would have kept doing DimGuard. Um, if it still had have been as stressful for me as it had been the last several, it wasn't new anymore. It just kind of turned into a, a hectic problem to be solved and an ad hoc method every month. But like I say, that three weeks in November um, did, it, did wonders for our process, and we're ha very happy for that. Uh, another thing that I've been focused on this past week um, is that Beginning in February, we intend to premiere a Dim Guard title from an upcoming volume or, or Patreon every month. Uh, so in February, we're looking at, at uh, probably an up one for, for the March releases um, at Winter Fantasy. We're, we're working it. Uh, we may be too late for Winter Fantasy. Um, but then... Uh, well, and the impetus for this is like in August, we did Gen Con. And while it was hectic, um, it was productive. I, I enjoyed it a lot. Got a lot of good uh, of feedback out of it. And so we're going to do that every month. Um, we hope and expect to get into Winter Fantasy each year to do Winter Fantasy, um, Origins, and Gen Con. But then there are, you know, month in and month out, there are another tier of regional conventions that are um, important to the community that we would like to get involved with. Um, this goes back to our, our goal of getting DimGuard out of this isolated sort of niche environment into the mainstream. Uh, we had hoped to do that through DMs Guild. DMs Guild was not receptive. Um, they were very clear that they... Um, don't like what DimGuard has done, that they view us as a splinter group. Um, and despite my sincere and expressed goals to change that and integrate DimGuard into a more mainstream situation, um, they were just very clear that, no, we don't want you. Now, there's still some stuff we're going to publish on DMs Guild because we like DMs Guild and we want to support DMs Guild. Um, but the entire lot, but most uh, that will that will be at most a a supplement or two a month. The adventures are still going to be on drive through RPG. You just that's it. they just don't want them. Um, so uh, so that's what's been consuming my time. Um, uh, reconciling things with the DMs Guild unsuccessfully. Um, evaluating the conclusion of Volume Twenty Three on Kickstarter and um, planning for convention play um, in 2018. So thanks a lot for checking in. Um, I, if you're not uh, with the Patreon or backing the Kickstarters, then we would like for you to consider that, um, of course. Uh, even if you come in at the lowest level, where we intend to make those uh, something of value going forward. Um, and we will be releasing that information on Monday on exactly what we're going to be doing maybe Tuesday with the uh, dollar level backing of both the volumes and the Patreon. So have a good weekend, uh, and I, I hope you get a chance to play some good D&D.